Do you think we'll ever see Tyson Fury, Anthony Joshua? Why not? <laughs> Why not? It's the only fight I was ever interested in. I was never interested in Deontay Wilder. I made a clear point to that Why? in previous videos. Because I thought Britain deserved that fight between, at the time, the two belt holders. Mm. But now it's gone. Even if he fought tomorrow, it would never be the same. Because it's not the same stigma anymore. Yeah. You know, even though he can come back and do this, that and the other. It should have happened this year, that, mm. between them two. But politics are boxing again, read its ugly head. And here we are today, which I knew all this was going to go wrong. I knew it, even though I thought myself, AJ might pull it off because he's a bigger, stronger, more, you know, more of a gigantic physique on him. I thought just out hustle him. And I did think he had devil in his work from his previous fights. That when he got up off the canvas with Klitschko, when he come back to win then, so I thought he'll do it with Usyk. But when I watched him fight Usyk, it wasn't the man I was looking at. It wasn't the age I seen previous different fighter altogether. Why do you think that was? I just think he thought he only needed to do so much. I think he thought he was at home and he's going to get a points decision. Sit behind his jab. I thought he thought he's the house fighter. He's the big name. The judges are going to be fair to him. You know what I'm saying? But listen, it was a one-sided beatdown and it was his own fault. Mm. Plus his corner was saying to him, you know, get behind the jab, just jab, not try and win. I think they're just trying to keep him in the fight. But it's what he's done outside the ring leading up to that. It's a culmination of things what leads up to a defeat, especially with a man like him. And I think it's the way he's lived his life outside the ring before the fights and all this kind of thing. There's, there's a lot to it. Mm. You know, there's a lot of things can lead up to a bad performance. And he just had a bad performance, but it's cost him dear. Yeah. But can he resurrect it? Yes, he can. What do you think will happen in the Usyk rematch? If he fights like that, nothing. He's got to change his game up. He's got to get physical with him. He's got to use his 18 stone, his strength. He's got to bully him to death. He's got to take him into a dog fight like Tyson did with Wilder. If he's not prepared to do that, same result. Because mm. Usyk, he's a fine champion, fine boxer. Probably the most technically gifted boxer he is. You know, and he's a very dangerous guy. And what makes him dangerous is that will to win again. Because he took some stick off AJ. He took some big, hard, heavy shots. Mm. And he wants a win, does Usyk? You know, so yeah, it's a tall order. Because I think he's a great champion. Yeah. And I think it'll be a good fight between him and Tyson. But will he beat Tyson, though? No. Definitely not. Tyson's too big. And he can box equally as good as he can when he trains to do that. So let's just see. Mm. Let's just leave Anthony Joshua to his own job. He's got yeah. a mountain to climb, but I'm yeah. sure he can. If anybody can, he can. Mm. You know, but good luck to the kid. But a nice kid. Mm. I do like him. Mm. There's no harm in liking people, is there? No. No harm no in being harm. nice either, is no. there? No. Definitely not. Mm. I always thought he was a good boxer. They don't give gold medals away, special Olympic ones. No. You know, you know, he's done great things. And I mean, he's given me some good thrilling nights, as AJ. Mm. Edge of the seat stuff with my cup of tea, a tea sandwich, <laughs> some decent viewing, you know, yeah. but I, I was disappointed when we never got the AJ fight because all I wanted, you know, because that's what the British public deserved and they never got it, been deprived again. Mm. I don't know why, mm. you know, but there you are, that's life. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Now, if you like this, we have a full deep interview, the uncut, unedited version. So if you want to watch that, the link is below, but first make sure you like this video and subscribe to the channel.